Welcome back to another video. If you're new to the channel, I am Rio. Today's video, as you can see from the title, I have to do a severe closet clean out. If you saw my winter clothing haul, I think it was, you may have recalled me saying that I needed to get rid of a lot of clothing, a lot of pieces. My wardrobe is just, it's overly done, it's jam packed, and I gotta do something about it. This essentially is just a drawback from what I do on this platform and basically what I do for work. My closet's there, as you can see, so all of the clothes in there. I won't be getting rid of everything, but a lot of it has to go. I'll take you over here so you can see. A lot of these shirts in here gotta go, a lot of these jackets gotta go, a lot of this stuff gotta go, and then some of this, and then I have stuff down here and all down here so you get the drift a lot of this stuff will be put on my website down below imrealp.com backslash shop my closet so if anything that you see that i'm getting rid of you can find it there and hopefully that stuff will be up by the time this video goes live and a lot of you may be wondering about some of the sneakers will i be getting rid of some of those and i will i don't know exactly what i'm getting rid of yet but i know i need to because there's a lot of stuff that I'm just not wearing. And some of the stuff, even though I may not be wearing it, some of it's like a little more sentimental, but the things that really doesn't hold much meaning or value, it's time to let go. I figured I would get started with some of the long sleeve shirts and jackets. So let's get to it. Two are some of my favorites, but I've worn them, got use out of them. Now it's time to let them go to somebody who will get more use out of them than I do now. One of the reasons I want to get rid of so many things is because I want to be able to provide as much inspiration as I can for you guys. And I kind of feel like I haven't really done the best job at doing so because every time I do outfit styling videos or outfit inspiration videos, the pieces that I'm using, the garments that I'm wearing, they're essentially recycled stuff that I've had in my wardrobe for a, a long time. And that's not always the case. Of course, I have pick up things here and there, but I want to be able to provide inspiration from things you guys can actively get. And I know I won't always be able to do that. That's kind of how things work but I want to be able to do it more often than I have been. And what that means is I got to be a little more fluent. That's the best word that come to my head right now. I got to be a little more fluent and somewhat proactive with getting pieces in and getting pieces out so I can get them, use them, help you guys style these pieces. And when they don't have the value for me to create with anymore, then they can move on. So behind me, this big pile here, these are all pieces that I really do like, but I've learned that they don't really serve much of a purpose for me anymore when it comes to creating. Again, for that reason, I will be getting rid of them. And again, everything will be linked down below on my website or my website will be linked down below and all these pieces will be on there for you guys to grab. Zara Vess, really like this piece, bought it last winter, worn it maybe once, twice if that. I like it. It's thinking enough wear out of it. Then we have some hoodies here, uh, some other flannels. Oh, this Zara um, texture jacket. I love this piece a lot. Again, it's something that I really do like, just not wearing as much. So for that reason, gotta gotta let it go. And then there's so many pieces, so many pieces. I you know I can't go through all of them. I can't really go through everything, but as you can see, there is quite a bit that I am getting rid of. And this is just the beginning. I have this whole, wait, I went through that one already. Uh, at the end, <laughs> this one here, that end there, I have to go through that one, I have to go through all the bottoms, as well as take pictures of all of this stuff. So uh, yeah, let's get to work. The 
other hard part about it is not knowing what to get rid of. Uh, there's some things I'm holding on to because I feel like I may want to wear them. I feel like I may need them. Then I remind myself that I actually haven't worn them and I don't know how long. And then in the future, I probably won't wear them. And there's some things I will keep outside of content. There's some things I'll still wear outside of content. And those are usually just like essentials. But for the things that I feel like they're not necessarily trendy, but essentially I just won't wear those. Those got to go. I'm going to look more up here, see what else I can take. And then we're going to focus more on the drawers and then my bottoms. This is where the stack is currently at. I don't even know if you can tell how many pieces are here, but yeah, it goes down to the bottom right here. We have some suits, some overcoats, some blazers, jackets, that kind of stuff, and dress shirts. I'm honestly I'm not going to get rid of too much of it. Uh, I think some of the blazers can go. Some of the suits, I'm going to keep suits and some of maybe a couple of these. This piece, absolutely one of my favorites. I know it's kind of dark. It's from a brand called Life After Denim. One of my favorite blazers I've had for a very, very long time. I haven't worn this thing in probably a couple years. It's time to say goodbye. All right, so I have quite a bit of stuff taken out of my closet. And again, this time I was focusing mainly on tops. So long sleeve, uh jackets that kind of stuff essential stuff i left are like regular jackets hoodies biker jackets t-shirts those kind of things which are mainly essentials now it's time to go through all of the bottoms and see what i can take care of and get rid of i know my jeans pants and denim needs a lot of work because i haven't done anything to those in a very long time so it's time to go through some of those <laughs> I went through every single piece of clothing that I own and decided to keep or not to keep. Trying pieces on left and right, trying to figure out if I still value them. And this is what we currently have. That mountain has grown quite a bit. I took out so many of the jeans and the denim and this is what I'm gonna keep. I do have some more in the back though that I may bring out, but so far, this is what I'm gonna keep. And then all of the jeans are all here. There's actually quite a bit. They're folded and stacked in there. And now it's time to tackle all of these. Sorting, organizing, and taking pictures from one day to the next. Tons and tons and tons of items. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I just couldn't film it all. This is it. This is everything that I am currently selling. Well, it's not necessarily everything, but I would say it's probably about 65 to 70% of what I'm selling. The other 30 to 35% is in a box in the back. This has been a process. This entire video was over the span of, I would say about a month, at least over the month, I would think easily. I know I haven't posted a video in a while and the main reason for that is that i really wanted to work on downsizing this wardrobe like i mentioned earlier in this video and like i said sometime a little while back i lost space for stuff and in order for me to feel like i could create freely and think freely i just really had to work on downsizing the wardrobe 
and also have some other plans which I want to do within my space. If you guys are interested in any of these pizzas that I'm going to be selling, of course, you want to visit IamRealP.com slash shop my closet and everything will be listed on there because I didn't want to make this video, post this video and then take time to list everything on the website. I made sure I did that before finishing this video. So I took the time, which took probably like two weeks to list every single piece. And it is over 200 pieces that I'm getting rid of out of my wardrobe. That includes the clothes and the shoes. I think there's at least 20 pairs of shoes that I'm gonna be selling. Again, everything will be listed on the website. I made sure I got everything done for you guys. I didn't want this video to go live and then the stuff not be there. So everything, as soon as the video go live, will be published on the website. So again, visit it, check it out, see if anything interests you. I feel like the majority of it is listed extremely reasonably. Most of it is pre-owned, some of it is new. And whatever the condition is, of course, it'd be stated on that listing on the website. 200 plus pieces now live on the website. Check it out if you're interested. There is a lot more content on the way. I, you know, we've taken this break from making videos. Of course, I was getting all of this stuff done, but I haven't posted a video in almost two months. I know there's a lot of people who want to see hair transplant updates and want me to talk about hair stuff. I will be doing some of that, not too, too much, because I really want to keep my channel mainly focused with fashion and lifestyle. But you know, I will say hair is a part of lifestyle, so I will talk about it. Well, now we're in spring, so I got some spring content coming as well. So be on the lookout for that. But anyway, if you enjoyed this video, of course, you know what to do. Hit it with a thumbs up, hit it with a like. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new for future content and make sure you click the bell so you'll be notified whenever I drop a new video. And follow me over on IG as well. I, I know I don't post there as much, but that is also something that I'm working towards being more active on there. And that is a challenge that I have pretty much given myself to commit myself to that. So follow me over there if you guys want to see the content that I'll be producing there. Anyway, that does it for this video. All the pieces, all of the garments, all of the shoes, everything that I'm selling is on the website right now. As far as shoes, I forgot to say this, as far as shoes, I have some Jordans, I have some Yeezys, I have Nikes, I have you know, pretty much anything that was in my wardrobe or within my shoe collection that I feel like I wasn't gonna wear or haven't really been wearing, it's on there. So check it out. Hopefully you guys will find interest in something. Hopefully you guys will purchase some of these pieces. Uh, yeah, that does it. I'm gonna catch you guys on the next video very soon. Peace.